Hello everyone, my name is Sick, and welcome to the 26th episode of my War of the Chosen playthrough. I ran into a bit of trouble thanks to the latest update to Windows 10, because it screwed up uh, the settings that I use for my recording program, and as such I didn't actually record my voiceovers for this, uh, this particular episode. But some major significant, leave or significant things happened. We undertook a mission that basically stopped the avatar progress or uh, avatar project from progressing by two blocks. So for a second there, I was afraid that I was going to get my entire squad wiped. It was very rough going. I ran into the uh, Snake King again as well, and I whittled him down to just one HP. So the next time we see him, he should definitely be dead. Um, but yeah, other than that, we managed to complete two very important bits of research for the storyline. And the reason I still put out this video is because I want to show you those two cutscenes that come along with those two really important research uh, moments. Because if you haven't paid attention to the story yet and you're kind of following it through my missions, which I kind of doubt, but you know, <laughs> if you are, then this is for you. So please enjoy these cutscenes, and I'll see you guys for the next episode, where I should have actual commentary once more. See you guys later. Still can't believe it's come to this. I truly hope those gruesome images are the worst of what we find today. They're slaughtering us, Doctor. What could be worse? We're about to find out. I've patched the shadow chamber directly into the ship's computer. It's been sifting through the material we've recovered non-stop since our return, cataloging sequences. Genetic sequences, in near-infinite combinations, yet all bearing similar genetic markers. Human markers. There must be thousands of them. Tens of thousands, and the procedure is still nowhere near complete. Which is why we need the ship's computer to find out where they came from by cross-referencing them with the data we've managed to hack from the Advent Network. It's... an admission file from one of the gene therapy clinics. Avatar. Just what exactly is in that vial? In my worst nightmares, I would never have imagined. Doctor. I believe we have found the missing civilians. That's... That's impossible! The gene clinics. Millions of people, just looking for help. Medically screened and selected. Suitable candidates taken to that contemptible facility to be processed, refined into the material we now possess. But why do this? I could not begin to fathom a guess at this point. There exists no research that would ever warrant this. It's genocide, Doctor. And these people are walking right into it. We may not know what they're doing with this stuff, but I think I can find out where it's going. Got it. A high security production facility. Standard defensive complement. Then I strongly suggest we pay them a visit, Commander. Agreed. The information we gain could prove invaluable towards stopping the aliens' true agenda. <laughs> We're making progress piecing this thing back together, but it hasn't been pretty. Our soldiers completely disabled this unit in the field. What we're hearing is merely a byproduct of electrical impulses. I assure you, it is well past the point of feeling pain. I'll take your word for it, Doctor. I'm sending you a new sequence now. These are coordinates. Return coordinates. Think we've got a point of origin. Well, part of one. Something else. Something underneath. One more. The unit is attempting to block further access. That's not all it's doing. And losing the data we've already decrypted. Almost there. Just one more adjustment. <laughs> Accessing the power core, overriding my safety, increasing power levels to die and sever the connection. There.
Some sort of fail-safe protocol, I imagine. The Codex must have intentionally overloaded the interface to prevent any further theft of information. Still, I believe I was one step ahead of it. That's an enormous amount of data. Yes, and I expect it may take some time to decipher. Better get started. I don't think we're gonna be able to do that again. I'll proceed with the necessary research and preparation. With your approval, of course, Commander. I'd also suggest we look into those coordinates. That's if I can reconstruct the data we lost in the transfer. I just hope it was worth it. <laughs> <laughs>